Hello, welcome to Power Query Fundamentals Masterclass. In this video, I will talk about how to create columns from samples. Let's get started. To do it, I open Bangladesh Excel Summit folder. Then I go with uh, PQ Masterclass working files. And from this folder, I select this Create Columns from Samples Excel Workbook. So it's my workbook here. It's all the data is given in Excel official table format and name is uh, samples. So the first step is to upload this data into Power Query editor. So let's go with data, say from sheet and here my data is going to be uploaded into Power Query editor. So let's wait for a while and then let's start how to make some uh, create some columns. So this is my Power Query editor. So first of all, uh, I leave. I don't change the name of my query. It's samples. It's okay for me. And I see two steps: source, change type. It's also okay for me. But however, I can make slight changes. For example, here my date is given as a number. So I go to this column, say change to date. It's going to be changed, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, it changes here. Then I go with item column. It's in text format, which is correct. It's also correct, correct, correct. And here it's also correct in her format. Let's go on with the other columns. As for price, it can be say uh, in decimal that's good let's say okay so everything is perfect so uh, let's pay attention to my table here i have my item which is consisted of two parts for example product one product one product four etc also here i have my sales representatives name surname then what else we have? I have my numeric values. So let's do some columns based upon samples. First of all, we have to go to add column, say column from examples, just click on it. And one column is going to be open. You may see this new column here. And also in this part, we'll have the necessary function syntaxes. So, for example, I would like to get only names of sales representatives. So, how can I do it? Is that I go to the first row of newly opened or created column, say um, Edgar, right? Then enter, and I see all the names of representatives. That's good. If I say OK, it's going to be uh, create one, say, column. And also pay attention to this part. Here I see one function, so called transform.text. Uh, actually, this is the action of transform, and the uh, name of function is text before delimiter, right? And uh, if I say here, Martin, say Martin, enter, and in this time, I'm just going to see all the surnames of my sales representatives and also pay attention to this part. You see the say function and it's like text dot after delimiter, blah, 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 blah. So, once again, if I say OK, the new uh, column is going to be created. But I say, I don't uh, click uh, neither of uh, neither OK or, nor cancel. I just go on showing you some more example. For example, I would like also to divide my items. Say, say product, product, and everything is going to be field like product. 
it's very possible you will need to extract your say date in month format to do it here i have my january i say january enter and everything is going to be filled like january because everywhere i have january months so uh, so far is everything is good and one more example i would like to show you for example i would like to say uh, multiply quantity with price for example I say, uh, I just enter the result. It is 116. Enter, sorry, sorry, 116. Enter, so just pay attention here. It, say, it says that please enter more sample values. So I go, uh, say 120, enter. And everything is going to be filled. After the second step, Power Query understands that user wants to multiply quantity with price. And one more thing I would like to tell you is that, for example, I would like to say that sales representative uh, located in region sold some amount of product. So I say, Edgar. Martin, sorry, Edgar Martin in Baku sold 16, say, uh, say, product one. Enter. Uh, so, one more example I have to add. I say Gafur Orjlu in initially sold 12 uh, product one. I think it's correct. It must be correct. Yes, product one. Say okay. All right, say OK. Oh, I have forgotten here to enter full name. Kafur, yes, OK. And everything is going to be filled. So based upon my pattern, it's all about creating columns based upon samples. See you in next video.